So I thought I'd do a little video here about butcher day and our setup before we get any chickens out. These are our layers. They just came out of the laying coop. But in the distance you can see our broiler coop. We got a nice big run on the back with water and um, they got a lot of room to move in there. We have about 40 to butcher today. Uh, so the first, we, have a, we usually use about four people. The first person is the grabber and cone person. So they go in and grab two chickens at a time, hold them by their feet, carry them over here to the cones, um, leave them in the cones for a minute or so. They usually pass out before uh, they slit their neck and let them bleed out after they've been in the cones for a few minutes uh, and they're not bleeding anymore or much. Um, the next person grabs them and the second person is the dunker plucker. So the water's heating up right now. We keep it at about 140 for the dunking. Um, and we use some dish soap in that water and sometimes we add a little bit more in order to uh, keep the oil oils from making the water really greasy after that. Uh, so they get held by their feet, dunked for about 10 seconds, pulled back up, dunked for another 10 seconds, and by then the feathers should be coming off pretty readily. Then they get put into the plucker. The plucker is a barrel with some rubber fingers in it, and the bottom spins mm -hmm. on this switch. So you pulse it a few times and they bounce around and uh, usually one of the kids is spraying them to help the feathers come off. The, uh, that person will then put the plucked chicken into the first bucket of ice water. We use frozen uh, ice cream pails to make big buckets of ice. After they hang out in there for a while, we move them to a cleaner bucket of water. Then um, the butchers, they hang out there till the butchers are ready for them. There are usually two butchers because that's what takes the longest. So they can hang out there nice and cold before the butchers grab them. The butchers grab them and butcher them completely and then put them into a nice ice filled cooler. We'll get one more cooler out here today because we've got about 40 chickens to do. And you can see that we keep a bucket of uh, soapy water to rinse hands in, some rags, gloves, and then we do keep a, a bleach solution, 10 to 1 bleach solution on hand to just make sure we can wipe everything down and keep everything nice and sanitary. So that's our setup. Hope you enjoyed seeing kind of how everything works and we'll take some more videos and pictures as we're butchering today.